name is K. Felix, and I will come you to K. Felix Inspire. Always remember, if you're coming here for the first time, please don't forget to subscribe. Hit the bell icon so that you get notified whenever I post new videos. Please do stay tuned for more details in this video. You, my fond memories of Zambia. <laughs> when I visited there as a child, I just showed you a photograph of myself at five years old, um, posing in front of the Parliament building there, and um, and so I I warmly welcome you to the White House. Indeed. Thank you. Well, thank you very much, uh, Vice President, and uh, I must start also by congratulating you. It's a bit late, but we did it at the right time. Uh, you and the president for winning your elections here mm -hmm. um, in a, I think, decisive way. And uh, we're following in your footsteps. Uh, we too were delivered by the people of Zambia in a substantial way under very difficult circumstances, democratic uh, space not being available mm -hmm. since you talked about democracy. So, but we're very grateful to be here, to be invited to the White House after so many years of uh, leaders before us who were not able to be invited here. So we feel honored, uh, Vice President, that we're here. And I think you touched on the most important issues, the important issues to do with uh, valuing democracy, valuing democracy, the rule of law, institutionalism, if I may use that expression, uh, for us to be able to run our countries in a manner that would deliver what we may call Democracy dividends. That's right. Delivering accelerated economic you know, growth development to offer opportunities to our people. I think, uh, Vice President, that's what to sustain democracy. That's what will make democracy attractive. If we don't do that, we'll probably be giving space to other forms of leadership. And the one we fear most or we don't agree most is one which is autocratic, yeah. one which is heavy-handed. Mm -hmm. We were almost getting there in Zambia. So we're very delighted that um, the people of Zambia, especially the young people, decided to give us this mandate. And we intend to use this mandate very carefully, diligently, to deliver for them. Of course, the issue of climate change is very important. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you may have noticed that uh, for the first time in the history of our country, we've set up a ministry of green economy mm -hmm. and environment to deal specifically with issues relating to uh, the greenhouse gases, so we, we can say, to make sure that uh, whatever we do to grow our economies, to provide for our people, we should not do it at the expense of future generations. It's very important to us. And I think it's also clear to us that uh, we have alignment in our values. Mm -hmm. What we believe is right, what we think is right for other people. That's very important to mm -hmm. us. And we share that vision. We're glad to be here. Thank you very much. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Madam President, yes, please perform so Yeah, thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. 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 Thank